Hola, como esta señora? Oh, I decided to take on another project. Because as y'all know, if y'all follow me, I moved out my house because of mold into my RV. And I love it. I'm like a big kid in a clubhouse every night. So, uh... I bought the corn roaster. The corn roaster was inside of this cart. That's a nice ass trailer too. Y'all probably seen it on my page. Like I said, if y'all follow me, I was gonna make it a hot dog cart, but I'm gonna make it a kitchen that I could cook in it because I like to cook. But cooking in an RV can be a little cramped. So this is it. I I got a full size refrigerator in the stove that I'm going to put back there. I'm taking the deep freezer out. Don't need the deep freezer. Taking this table out. All this stuff's going to come out, more than likely. The flat top will stay in there. I bought this table, and I'm going to put sinks in this table. The small portable sinks, like I got in the corn roaster. And I'm going to set of cabinets. But today I just had to get that opened up and figure out what move I was going to make. It got windows. I got an air conditioner for it. It got an exhaust fan up front. I got a brand new fan for it in that box right there. You can see it sticking up. Uh, what I have to do, this gate comes off, but it doesn't attached to anything it's just later so what i'm gonna do first is i'm gonna cut this out and then hopefully the gate will come down and just i can use it as a gate to get the refrigerator and stuff in then i'm gonna put a bolt i'm gonna drill through here put a bolt in it use it as a ramp it had a serving table on here like this i took it off and First thing I'm gonna do is cut them out. Got to put lights in it. Only thing I gotta figure out is the stove and the refrigerator. I got a 50 amp power coming in up there at the box. It's behind the tables and stuff. I gotta figure out because the stove is, I wanna say 30 amps, but the refrigerator, you know, they draw a lot of power, but. I'm put the refrigerator stove back here where I'm at because it either goes back here or up front. I'm thinking up front might be best because that's where the breakers is. I don't know. Then I can leave this back open. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put the refrigerator stove up front. It makes the most sense. Then I can have all this room back here. And I could put the sinks back in one of these corners. I got to uh, close it off. Up here, this overhang. I guess if you're looking at me, this overhang is open. I need ideas to fill that in. I was going to fill it in with expandable foam, which is the easiest way to go. All the way around. And I'm thinking maybe I may put some paneling over this. It ain't really going to need insulation per se, but... I got some pink foam board. Whole big stack of it over there. I'm probably gonna, I need to start to taking the engine off these cars first, but that's what I'm up to now.